think I see some metal. Or is it plastic or wood? Oh, there's metal. Okay, good. Hmm, not metal enough. <laughs> well, good morning. Welcome to the Scrap and Pallet Man channel. Yeah. Let's go scrap it. Wow, look at that sun. That's nice. I like it. Wait, is that really copper? That's really aluminum. <laughs> that can't be copper. Oh, yes it is. Thank you very much. More. Are you kidding me? All right, I'm gonna make a mess, but I'll clean it up. Wow. <laughs> That's incredible. This is more copper. It is. What's in here? Some goggles. <laughs> more goggles. That's weird. Wow, that's some good copper right there. Wish I had another garbage can right here and I could dig through this a little bit better. Looks like someone's moving out or something. Seems how this is a vacant house and no one lives here, no, no one's over there. I can like just make noise. Ooh. No, I want no yicky chemicals on me. Oh, you're digging through the trash, you're gonna get those chemicals on you. Really? Okay. And a chair. That's wood. Looks like this is going to be a non-ferris kind of day. Wait a minute. You don't look so bad. Yeah. Anyway. Hey, remind me to tell you the story about my new tires. Yeah, those are brand new tires. You're going to be quite surprised. What's up, gooses? Okay, guess that's not going either. I think it's metal. Oh, it's wood, huh? Yeah, it's wood. I got tricked. Is that metal? I think it is. I can... <laughs> nope, it doesn't twist off. Ah, the whole thing all gonna go. <laughs> 
what is this I just rolled up on? Wow. Line up the metal. Wow. That's crazy. Look at all that. Skill saw, jacks, mower, weights, more weights, bicycles. Basketball Jones got a basketball Jones. Wow, it's already boxed up for me. How about that? Yeah, you're going in the passenger seat. Steel weights. Huh. That might be last if it's going at all. That big tangle mess. Starting off with a bowling knot over there and a clove hitch right here. And this will give me some spots to put some vertical items. Wow, that's just a lot of steel. What is this? Very decorative. <laughs> the littlest things will get tangled. Wow. What would that look be like if I had these all welded up here? Cling! <laughs> Untangle. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be kind of a mess to, to get out of the truck once I start to unload it at the scrapyard. Yeah, I don't know about that. This might have been here a while. Feels like it's kind of still frozen to the ground. It's above freezing right now. Which is a good thing. Chill. I guess just go straight down the line. Skill saw. You might work. You're going up front. Already a workout. <sighs> yeah, this has been here for a while. Looks like. I will clip it in a second. Oh. 
What is that? Is that the biggest drill bit ever? Seriously. I think I want to keep that. I want to hoard it. Those are brass. Hmm. It's a big Milwaukee bag. Do you want to keep it? <laughs> Maybe. Uh oh, kids are all going to school. <clears throat> all right, clip the cord of that. Process a scrap scene. <sighs> huh. no, I don't think I want this bag. Just the metal. Or do I? It's a lot of bits. A lot of brass. Tools. <laughs> okay. I'll keep you for later. Sure, where I'm gonna put you though. <sighs> That's gonna small truck problems, definitely. Bud's like, you're going with me. Oh. All right, moving right down the line. New dent in my truck. Brand new dent. Guess these are fit onto a table for a little torch. Weights are next. <laughs> Skull, dude. What's up, Skeletor? Oh, 25 pounds. Those things just pull the heat right out of my gloves. Wow. <sighs> that fit. <clears throat> no, nope, that thing ain't budging. That thing's frozen to the ground. Oh, 
Look, it's a smackomatic training device. Yeah. And a bicycle, I think that's it. All right, what else going on here? I'm not doing tangle. Nope. I'll do a couple of these though. Yeah. Wait, a sawzall? Yes! I didn't even see that. Seriously. Are you kidding me? Wow. Okay, anything else? Blah, 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 blah. saw some metal. I like that brick house. Definitely. Yeah, that's metal. Yeah, yeah it works. Ooh, you might be aluminum. Aluminum, aluminum, aluminum. You are aluminum, you're steel. Can that go up front with me? So don't forget it. Extru extruded as well. Until it's not bent from a piece of sheet. Wow, we're getting kind of packed up here. Yep. Standing room only. <clears throat> Look at this old Malta fire truck. It probably isn't old. It has an old shape to it. Wow. Some cool stuff. I drive all slow next to the fire department. Got a brass for me. Hmm. Wow. That looks like a 22 inch bike. You know how they have you know, the BMX, which are 20 inch, then they got 24 inch. This looks like a 22. Rare, but. Maybe it's 24. It's certainly not 26. Huh. Yeah, it's 24. I, I can see it now. It looks smaller. They kind of skip that. They go from 20 to 24. All right, dude. Huh. You can tie it up on the outside. Maybe. Yeah, let's do that. All tied up. Let's go. Talk to my mower guy. He's like, yeah, man, I'll take that lawnmower. So a little bit of repairs, but I think this is a, this will work. Oops, <laughs> that stuff falls off of it. <laughs> Park it right here so we can still get into his garage. All right, I think I'm gonna go to my shop right now and take a bunch of stuff that's in the front seat and drop it off at my shop. Oh no. <clears throat> wow, that was kind of terrible. <laughs> so the broom fell over. <laughs> so the broom fell over and was behind here and I was like clunk, 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 ah. All right, yeah, so I, Brought over the uh, shelves from my storage unit over here. 
had some help putting this up from a awesome person and yeah so i'll bring the stuff in from my truck into here but yeah my goal is to is to get organized so i can do some of the uh taking stuff apart and where it's not like a just a total pain and what else was i gonna do i can't remember all right let's get the stuff out of the truck uh. This weird little thing I found in the, so I did a, I don't know, a couple days of me scrapping, just me out there scrapping without the camera. And I found this in the Union Pacific dumpster. This thing weighs a lot. I don't know what it is, but it looks like those things are copper. Yeah. I mean, that's a good 12, 15 pounds. So I don't know what you are. Okay. Let's finish getting that stuff out of the truck, then go finish scrapping. I don't know why I want to keep it. Yeah. Now let's go scrapping. Oh yeah, that's shred. <sighs> All right, so you need to go on the truck. That's shred too. Well, besides the trash, it's in it. Scatterbrain. <clears throat> and that bag needs to stay here. Now I can load this up. Wait a minute. You are stainless. <laughs> Looks like a toy. Like a Batman toy. Thanks for reminding me about those new tires. See these things? They're aluminum. And I didn't see a bunch of these in the scrapyard when I was doing some meat scrapping. And I had them covering a couple of tires. So I pulled one out. And they weren't just holes. They actually were gouges that would gouge out a section of my tire. So it wasn't like a plug, cause it would, it was like ripped open. So uh, the story is I called up the scrapyard and told them about it. I wasn't expecting anything. Um, and the guy's like, hang on, I'm gonna go out there and look. So he picked up dozens of these things that were just right in the road area. And um, so I won't say exactly what they did, but I was very pleased on their response. <laughs> very pleased with um, all of these things that were stuck in my tires. Yeah, those things are no joke. Is it, can you see, can you get a good look? It looks like broken glass. It's as sharp as broken glass, but it's, um, it's aluminum. All stuck in my tires. Pretty wild. So I mentioned I did some me scrapping. Oh, really? Right away, awesome. I did some me scrapping yesterday, or last few days. And uh, I moved, and this is no joke, I moved 15 appliances. Yep. That's a mower guy. So yeah, I moved 15 uh, appliances, and I'm a little bit sore. I'll tell you that much. Dude. Didn't I tell you you're supposed to be here when I first start scrapping? Uh, yeah, so it was uh, 
it was funny, you know, because if when I'm recording, like I'm doing right now uh, for the video, um, when I'm done scrapping, it's, you know, it's, it's a three or four hour process after I'm done scrapping. So let's say I scrap for, you know, three hours and then I go have some lunch, um, you know, and it, it, it turns into a full day. So this um, huge apartment complex gave me a call. Said, hey Paul, we got a bunch of appliance appliances. Our scrap guy has uh, he's missing in action, and uh, and we're uh, we're too full right now. He want to come get these appliances. I said, sure, man. So went over there, and uh, sure enough, they were loaded up with washers and dryers, and stoves, and refrigerator, a bunch of refrigerators, and uh, so basically three or four appliances at a time. I was able to uh, um, get the job done. But it's like I said, if I'm recording, it's just slower. Wow. Oh. Yeah, if I'm recording, it's just slower. And I wanted to just get the job done for them. So, and it was good. So it was uh, 15 appliances. It was over a hundred bucks I got for it. Yeah. But also had a, an issue with my tires. So yeah, I didn't have my camera with or anything, so I couldn't even record what it was like seeing all those things stuck in my tire. I was like, no. But they were totally cool about it. I mean, beyond cool. All right, this is not gonna be pretty. All right, how about taking the brass off first? So don't forget. Yeah, let's do that. Wait, that's righty tighty. Wrong. I still don't have a quick way of cleaning these things up to turn this into clean brass. Water gonna come out. Ooh. Rust to juice. Ooh. All right, dude, get in my truck. Getting more ridiculous. All right, let me get a rope. This ain't gonna cut it, is it? Oh, it'll keep it from falling out, I guess. What's up, my brother? How you doing? Good, man. What are you up to? Good seeing you, man. All right. Need a hand? Um, I can do it, but if you want to give a hand, I don't. I don't want to help you fall again. <laughs> Dude, that was nuts, man. So, how's your week going? It's all right. What do you guys do like on Monday and Tuesdays? What um, route do you do? Uh, I do. Uh, I'm in Sugar Grove. Okay. Sugar Grove, and then um. Oh, yeah. Grove and then Plato Center. 
Okay. Everybody else is in Montgomery. Okay. Um, where are they? We have a lot of rural stuff. Okay. Salmonox, Sandwich, Sheridan. Okay. And then Wayland, Wednesday, Wayland. Thursday, Friday, you're here. Uh, we are. Yeah. But I mean, like right now, there's a uh, four guys up in Belvedere, okay. Rockford area. Um, Montgomery is five days a week. There's two guys in really? Montgomery five days a week. Yeah. Okay. Thousand houses. So wow. there's a recycle garbage guy. Okay. Time in Montgomery. Um, I don't know. Yeah. We have 27 drivers. I mean, so they're. Oh. <gasps> so they're. Okay. You know, I mean, I don't know where the routes are. They're just. Yeah. Yeah, I only see like four or five of you guys. So. Yeah, we're only here Wednesday through Friday. Yeah, yeah. And then we're, you know, like Monday, Tuesdays, everybody else is up. Friday is just nuts, man. Friday's is huge. It is. Friday's yeah, is and huge. there's, there's, for me, waste management is doing Sycamore. Right. So it's like it's doubles, you know, it's just massive. So thanks, man. Yep. I appreciate you, bro. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. I, I really haven't seen much on my route. I don't yeah. know if the garbage guy beat it or, I mean, I would yeah. send you something. So yeah. No, it's, I, I mean. I would have sent you this. I was just coming up to it. Yeah. Yeah, which you it, that'd been fine. It's um I've gotten so much. I've already like went to my shop, dropped off a whole bunch of copper that I found. Oh yeah. Yeah. Nice. So yeah, all right. the money I had, man. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Alright, man. Take water heaters. Yeah. Okay, because we don't. Okay. That's so, so perfect. Anytime I see them, I'll let you know. I didn't know that you took them. Yeah. Yep. You know, is there copper in them or no, it's just shred steel. You okay. know, just like the other. They take it yeah. just like that? Yep. Okay. Just like that, yeah. I just take sometimes I take the little brass pieces off of it. Yeah. So Okay. Oh, right, man. I mean, if I'm on garbage, I do take them. Yeah. Because then the homeowners call in and complain, and yeah. then you gotta go back and get it anyways. Yeah. But, but they pay. You're right, right. You know. So instead of all that, like when I'm on garbage, just use I a grabber and just dump yeah. it in. Yep. Yeah. Or I'd stand it up and I'll just squat lift. Okay. Yeah. Cause, I mean, they're not super crazy heavy. No. Um. Well, but a lot of people will, like I don't know how they get them out to the street, and sometimes they don't they're half full of water. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, like, why don't they drain it in the basement and then dolly it up? Yeah. Like, I don't know how they get it out of the basement. Too. Yeah. Or Forty gallons of water, bro. Oh, is just heavy. Yeah. I mean, what's four times seven, whatever that is. Yeah. Or a 40 me, times don't, seven. Don't make me mad. <laughs> yeah. All right, man. I'll see you later, bro. Uh, all right. Thanks for the math. That's a lot to pull up stairs, you know? I need a laundry basket too. With a dinosaur? Oh, this is broken. Dude. <laughs> I see you. What up? Anything else good over here? <laughs> Another dent. Okay. Looks <laughs> like I got a picker over here. That's interested in a pile. I'm gonna wait till she's done. How's it going? Good. You don't mind if I do a little looking, do you? Well, is it metal? Yeah. Oh, right on. That's what I'm talking about. Looks like you guys are moving out, huh? Yeah, we closed on Friday. Wow, congratulations. Thank you. Good stuff. I'll be carrying it out. Oh, my. Is it one piece? Yep. Okay. Out of it, so. Okay, thank you. There's a kitchen toy box in the backyard forever. And... Uh, uh, feels like it's aluminum. Yep. Yeah, tires here if you want them. Uh, I can't do anything with the rubber. Oh, okay. Yeah, they won't uh, let me take it. Is that guitar broken? Oh, I need strings. Okay. 
Cool. Actually, I'll take it from here because I'm going to have to stack it. Okay. So, cool. Appreciate it. All right. Thank you, sir. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate your help and uh, flagging me down for something in your backyard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, and Ivan has. It's a base. All right. You're going with me. What? Uh, yes. I don't know all these nozzles are, but <laughs> is that a ray gun for my spaceship? And the nozzles. stuff wow look at that toolbox wait is this electric too nope I thought there might be a pickup in there you ruin it Paul don't fall behind my dash Oh yeah, that thing looks perfect, <laughs> totally does, there's nothing wrong with that. Looks like it's wider than my truck though, I wouldn't use it anyway, but I will put it on my truck to take it to my shop to sell it. It's definitely in good shape. Okay, anything else to take off the truck? Nah. I want to just empty the truck. All right, let's go to the scrapyard. All right, what's going on here with the scale? Don't make me sneak in. I'll do it. I'll do it. Ooh. You see that? Bam. 44,000? Yes, 4,460 pounds. That's what I'm talking about. That'll be 20 bucks, at least. This is absolutely crazy. Going inside? Uh oh. I'm gonna get runned over. Whoa! Alright, did you see that big old mess back there? Dude, I do not. Right, I need to kind of take a look at this. Hmm. I just want to be running over all this stuff, you know? I want to pull in right here, but I'm not running over all this stuff. No way. A chunk. Maybe back over there, but I have to go through all that. Oh, this is no bueno. This is no bueno. Any more of those little shards? Nope. I don't think so. They're all up over here. <sighs> Not good. All right. <sighs> Can I pull in over here? It's 
a hunk of brass. <laughs> Another hunk of brass. It just got intimidated by my snap tool. <laughs> All right, Michael. All right. Look at that. That's a trailer. Dude, it couldn't be any more beautiful. Must be close to 600 pounds. If I did my math right, I think it was 600. 580, 600, something like that. Oh, it is gorgeous out there. I didn't take my, my hoodie off. Man, you are hopping, dude. There's so much going on right now. <laughs> yeah, we're, um, sorry, we're doing good. <laughs> you keep saying that. <laughs> How you doing? Go ahead. Pretty good. That? All right. For an old fart, I'm doing all right, I guess. Yeah? We ain't getting any younger. No. <laughs> I'm 70, 80, 81. You're 81? 81. And yeah. you're still hitting the scrap yard, huh? Well, yeah. All right. Some guys give me stuff. Right. I'll have eight or ten bags in a can. What? And it's worth driving over there. Yeah. And coming over here, you know? Sure, sure. Thanks, man. I'll <laughs> see you later. Yeah. Well, all right. Have a good day. 28 bucks. Yeah. Thanks, God. What is this? Musical dumpsters? I like it. And thank you, God. You're amazing. You are good. Thank you for this wonderful day. And God, I just never want to just not be thinking about you, God. I need your help to stay focused on you and what you want. Thank you, God. In the name of Jesus, amen. Amen, amen, amen. I don't think I'm done scrapping. And now that I look at this a little bit more, it's actually in really good shape. It's just dirty. Yeah. Hmm. 
nothing wrong with that nope all right so I need to get my garbage can out of there back in here I want to do some rearranging in here but um, yeah I don't want <laughs> I don't think I'm done scrapping yet yeah I got some energy right now Looks like this one's been well used. Huh, those are the owner's guide and everything. It's recycled. Ooh. All right, older means heavier. Thing's way heavier. A little rust on it. Ooh. All right. You know what I'm gonna do? Pretty much what I did before, but try not to drop it sideways. on that side this time yeah this one's definitely a whack and smack oh but there's a safety latch that's good kind of beautiful out here it, it has to be pushing 50 50 Fahrenheit I don't know what is that 15 um, or so centigrade Celsius that's what I'm talking about yeah, I'm feeling good. Let's go get some scrap. The eater of scrap. Now this guy isn't. Morning, Ralph. Morning, Sam. That dude is awesome. Who woke the dogs up? Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's a scrap man. What's he doing? He's up in that second window. Not very excited about the scrap man showed up. Some people wonder, hey, does anyone ever yell at you for picking up the scrap or just the dogs? Just the dogs. Not sure what's going on here. There's normally two dumpsters right here. What in darnations? Is that scrap metal?
Wow. I'm cleaning something out. This little piece of metal wants to come with me. Wow. What's all that stuff? This must be a lunch or something. No one around. Oh, I'm getting another text. I'm wondering what store that is. That's closing. I know Pier 1 Imports is closing, but which one was this? So I only know like the behinds of stores. I don't actually know what stores they are. That's funny. All right, let's take a look. And it is a nothing store. I'm already taking all the signs down. I don't know what that was. Shows you how much I'm in retail. <laughs> what was that place? I have no clue, but they're cleaning it out. It was the old Barnes and Noble from that closed like a year or two ago. Yeah, that's what it was. Yep, that's a Barnes and Noble that had closed a long time ago. Okay. What is that? Like heater cores or something? It's a uh, getting my truck kind of something. That's for sure. Get in my truck. Oh yeah. Yeah, heater of some sort, I'm not exactly sure. Hopefully it's not crazy. Well, <laughs> hopefully it is heavy, but I don't want to feel the heaviness. I want the heavy for the money. I don't want the heavy for the hurting my wrists and stuff. Wow. Maybe it'll work. Ooh. What is that funky stuff? I don't know. That's some sharp stuff right there, boy. Glad I got my glove and not my skin. Would help if I turn the camera on. <laughs> so this is the Aldi dumpster. See what kind of chow they got. The chow dumpster. Mm -hmm. Grapes, some bread, cauliflower. No, that's uh, broccoli. I guess broccoli and cauliflower are like the same critter. <laughs> Different phenotype, same genotype. Yeah. I'm gonna guess 4,200 at the most. Maybe even 4,160. Huh, 40G20, okay. All right, same spot as last time. This isn't all mine. Yeah. But I did put this bicycle here, so I think I'm gonna get it out of the way. and bolts there okay dude you need to get out Whoa. 
get out. Keep you around. Always a good workout. Seventy-eight. Someone etched that in the concrete. I was ten years old. Hello, hello. Uh, I think it's scary. Yeah. yeah, we'll see. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, okay. Okay. Hey, Michael. I was wondering where you were at. <laughs> it's time for me to come back. So, how you doing, man? Good, um... Not too bad. It's when something starts not going according to plan that I start getting, um... Flustered. All right. But it's alright. We're not doing too bad. We can't. Getting frustrated is the human experience. But acting out, throwing fits, that's not good. Frustration is normal. I just want 20 things are happening at the same time. It's hard to zero in on the best way to approach mm. something. Yeah, well, you have to ignore the the bottom things and and just keep going, no matter how much they're screaming at you. And it, it's hard to do because you have a lot of people's like, okay, the squeakiest wheel gets the grease, shut them up. Um, but no, somebody, the priorities are first, you know. Yeah. So, thanks, you man. Can you be back? Um, no, I don't think so. You're done for the day. I think so. Yeah. Nice. All right, man. I'll see you. See you, man. Fifteen dollars and twenty cents. That's good. Thank you, God. God, you are amazing. Thank you for the energy today. Thank you for the uh, just the clear mind. Yeah, that's right. In the name of Jesus. Amen. <laughs>